why do men ask women that they've just met or barely know to send them pictures? It's something that a lot of women want to know the answer to. And one woman specifically asked me this question and I thought, you know what, let's turn this into a video. So her question was, can you please tell me what's with the pic request? Met a guy only over social media through a mutual friend maybe 10 days ago. We are connected on social media and currently he is already asking me to send pictures. Nothing risque, just generally speaking. I find this rather odd. My response to him was that pics are earned. I mean, I'm not a complete prude. However, I'm not comfortable with this request. Am I out of line? This is a question and an experience that a lot of women share. So in this video, our objective is going to be to help you develop your perspective for understanding why men do request these pictures from women that they barely know or have just met. Let's get started. First, to answer your question, are you out of line? No, you're not out of line because you're allowed to be different. You're allowed to be unique because all of us play the games of life and love very differently. Some of us in that situation, we might not have a problem sending pictures to a guy that we just met. And some of us might very much feel like, yeah, that's not something that I do. And like you, a lot of people may feel that, well, pics are earned. So there's nothing right or wrong going on here. But there are some things that I think you should be aware of and understand regarding men. Because the better that you understand men and how they view dating and pictures, the better you can sort of assess if you're out of line or if you're in line or if the next time you're in that situation, if you'd handle it any differently. Sometimes we overestimate men and think they know what to say or do in a situation and often we don't realize men are not experts in the games of love and do stupid things just as much as women and maybe more so because men are expected to take more action. In today's society, more men are playing out their lives online. And in today's society, more men are experiencing the rushes from life from what is possible. And for many men, in-person experiences aren't as common as desired. And getting a picture, even if it's an online experience, is a rush. Getting pictures can make a man feel special, which is something that everyone wants to experience, male or female, everyone likes feeling special. Getting pictures makes a man fill with excitement to find out what he might have received. Is it a picture of her looking really pretty? Does she show off her body? Is it a sexy pic? Is it a nude pic? It displays interest. If a woman sends a guy a picture, a guy will perceive that to be because, well, she's interested. He asked for a picture and she gave it. And even if it's not a great picture or a sexy picture, it does display a level of interest. Demonstrates compliance. Asking for and receiving a picture is, in a way, a compliance test from a man. Will she do what he wants because she likes him? Even if a guy doesn't know that's exactly what he's doing, this is an element of what's going on. Sometimes, we need to remind ourselves that when we meet someone online for a romantic purpose, especially on social media and not even a real dating app, we have to recognize that the odds are that the guy trying to make romantic connections on a social media app is not the most socially savvy. We would expect those people to be, well, a little weird sometimes, right? Doesn't make them bad people, just we shouldn't be too surprised if they're awkward at times. Remember, when we're online, we all act differently than we would in person. We're kinder, but we're also meaner, but we're also more risk takers. We also maybe might ask a woman for a picture from behind our phone screen when in person, we'd never be so bold or awkward. Ladies, I understand that single life, dating and dealing with men, it's not easy. It can be challenging and confusing and even at times frustrating. And that's why in this video, I wanted to help you develop your understanding and perspective towards this phenomenon. Because if you're gonna remain single, there will be a next time where a guy asks you for a picture. And there will be a next time where you feel that the request is a bit premature. But I want you to handle it a better way. I want you to handle it with the knowledge and wisdom and perspective that you've gained from this video. And from there, you can then decide if you want to care, not care, discard him, whatever. But I don't want you to automatically disqualify someone because they asked for you for a picture prematurely. I don't want you to automatically assume or qualify them as a loser, a weirdo, or a fuck boy or whatever. I want you to understand that in most of these situations, the guys are harmless or good guys who are just saying something wrong in your eyes. I mean, we all make mistakes. We all jump the gun. And sometimes, you know, guys are imperfect. And that doesn't make them bad guys. I wouldn't want you to miss out on a great opportunity just because the worst thing that he did was ask you for a picture too soon. And sometimes we jump the gun so far ahead, we assume when he asks for a picture, he's asking for a sexy picture or a nude. Not the case. You don't know what you don't know. So let's not put words in a guy's mouth, okay? 
He might be simply asking you for a picture so that he could save, uh, save your photo in his phone as your contact whenever he texts you. All right. Very different sort of reason, right? One, you can be like, fuck that guy. He just wants nudes. And the other one is like, oh, he has intentions of really connecting with me and just wanted to put my face as the contact. Hmm. I feel stupid if I would have rejected him for that. So let's not jump the gun on that. Look, all of us are going to be very different in the games of love. And when it comes to sending pictures, I get it. We all have our different boundaries. If you have a hard and fast rule about not sending pictures, that's fine. But maybe you can say that in a way that doesn't make him run off, okay? And if you feel like it's just not the right time, well, there's nothing wrong with expressing that in a way that doesn't make him run off. And if you do not have a problem with sending a picture, send him a picture. And if you need to qualify what the picture is going to be exactly like, what are you talking about? What sort of picture are you talking? Well, just ask him that rather than assuming. But I think we need to have a little bit more discussion sometimes regarding, I don't want to send a picture so soon, or I don't send them really. Uh, I'm just uncomfortable about sending pictures or what sort of picture are you talking about? Let's make sure that we don't waste opportunities because you know what? A lot of great guys send these requests for pictures and a lot of times it's premature. It doesn't make them terrible guys. Sometimes you just need to bring it to their attention and they'll understand. I wouldn't want you to miss out on a great guy. You all think about that? Any thoughts, throw them in the comments. Anything else, I'd love to hear what you guys have to say about what I shared in this video. You all take care. Thanks for watching. If you appreciated the content, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And if you believe that learning about better strategies for life and love is advantageous, I invite you to join Get Game Group. Membership is free, open to men and women, offers weekly game video lessons, and a weekly mailbag for member submissions. Click the link in the description to join.